All right, for the first time, we're seeing incredible images of a World War II U.S. Navy destroyer found in the world's deepest shipwreck dive. We're talking more than 21,000 feet under the Pacific. CNN's Ivan Watson with the incredible images. This is the world's deepest known shipwreck, located more than four miles or some 6,500 meters below the surface of the Pacific. The numbers 557 identify it as the USS Johnston, filmed for the first time underwater by a remote-controlled submersible. This destroyer was one of several U.S. Navy ships sunk battling a vastly superior Japanese fleet during a furious battle off the coast of the Philippines during World War II. These little ships, fighting a desperate battle for time, used everything in the book to stay afloat. How did you feel seeing the ID numbers of the USS Johnston? In a way, it's um, painful, uh, but in another way, it's inspirational. Former U.S. Navy Captain Carl Schuster says he and his fellow officers studied the story of the Johnston and its commander, Ernest Evans, the first Native American naval officer to be posthumously awarded the Medal of Honor. He moved without orders. He saw an imminent danger to the fleet, and he moved on it on his own authority. Evans bought time for vulnerable American transport ships by attacking a fleet of 23 Japanese warships. His actions started a charge, if you will, that ultimately saved several thousand American lives at the cost of his own and, and much of his crew. 186 crew members, including Commander Evans, died aboard the Johnston. The Johnston was mapped by Caledon Oceanic. Over the past decade, several other World War II wrecks have been discovered in the Pacific by expeditions led by the late Microsoft co-founder Paul Allen. Navies around the world treat these sites as sacred war graves. I see them as the tombs or cemeteries of brave men who died fighting for their country, whether they're German, Japanese, or American. The mapping of the USS Johnston brings some closure for surviving relatives of the ship's crew. A grateful people will remember their names. The Gambia Bay, the USS Cole, the Johnston, the Samuel B. Roberts. But the final resting places of the three other ships sunk during the same deadly battle have yet to be found. Now, John, Caledon Oceanic, the private company that brought us those amazing images, is not sharing the exact location of the USS Johnston with any organization besides the U.S. Navy. And that fits the pattern of other expeditions that have found these sunken warships from World War II. And the reason is they're worried about looters and people trying to dig into the wrecks to take away uh, souvenirs or even to take valuable metal and sell it later for scrap metal. That that has happened to ship other World War II shipwrecks. They want to preserve the memory hmm. of this wreck and and war grave. E even yeah. at, even at twenty one thousand feet, there there people can go and looter. just steal steal the supplies. Okay, that one's going to be a little difficult. <laughs> <laughs> but clearly, it has happened uh, in the in the Java Sea. There are a number of wrecks there, American as well, and there have been signs of entire ships disappearing and probably sold for scrap metal, which is tragic. It is an amazing story. Uh, Ivan, thank you so much for bringing us those pictures. Just stunning to see and such history there. 62% deeper than where the Titanic was found. You just did the math off the yeah, top I did. of your head. I was just, I was just writing here on the back of the envelope. Very impressive.